AMD's Polaris may be coming sooner than we thought. So AMD's Polaris technology is a fourth generation GCN architecture that's going to be on the new 14 nanometer node. Now one of the big things that we pointed out early on with Polaris's unveiling was a significant performance per watt improvement over its predecessors. And we discussed that that was going to lead to a GPU that was designed for small form factor and portability as well as battery life and just efficiency all in all. Now what's fun about this is we were told uh, mid 2016 availability. Well it looks like mid 2016 could be a little bit earlier than we expected. Up on Engadget, they posted the new Lenovo Yoga Flex and uh, Mix. Now, one of the fun things about this that we caught was the Flex 4, also called the Yoga 510 internationally. It's going to be available in a 14 and 15 inch configuration, and it's going to have a variety of uh, components such as the i7, up to 8 gigs of RAM, and of course SSDs. But the biggest thing is they went ahead and listed here that it's going to cap out at the AMD Radeon R7 M460 GPU. Now, that's the 400 series, and looking at this and everything that we can find on it is showing this is not a rebrand so this is not a previous generation GPU being stuffed into a new laptop this is in fact Polaris so we're looking at possibly one of the first uh, implementations of this GPU which is going to be on the mobile side which isn't unsurprising for the you know the features that it brings but uh, what do you have to say about this? Are you interested? Uh, did you expect mo mobiles to come out first with a mobility GPU? Were you expecting the flagship to show up first? April? April's when it's shipping. So are we going to see other uh, 400 class <laughs> GPUs in April? It's a pretty short amount of time from now. We're looking at just over a month. So things are about to get heated up in the next generation of uh, graphics cards. So stay tuned for more news here at WCCF Tech TV. Subscribe and we'll see you on the website.